I mean, she, she was a child. She was 16 years old. She's still a child. It's not easy to digest. We were all guessing who it was because, and we started thinking like, it had to have been the, the little girl who was there because we've never saw, saw them. The Mesa County Sheriff's Office has been working with the Colorado Bureau of Investigation on the case of the remains found in a Grand Junction home nine months ago. The Sheriff's Office says DNA from the remains belonged to an Amanda Overstreet. The last record we have of her being seen is in 2005, um, and we do not have any records relating to her disappearance or that she was ever reported missing by anyone. Her remains were found in a freezer after the new owners of the home were looking to clear out what was left on the property. According to neighbors, there were clues of foul play. I'd walk my dogs every, uh, about once every other day or so, and even just walking by the house, you just smelled like a mildew, and it was just like utter disgusting. Actually, like would make you sick just walking by. And they recall the last time they saw Amanda. Um, the last time we saw the little girl was actually when she was on her way to school. I don't know what, what school she was going to, but it, it's a fairly quiet neighborhood. Um, not there's not really we don't really talk to everyone here, but every so often when a neighbor passes another, they'll give like some updates about it. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.